Okay, so I thought I'd do a quickie update video for you guys watching the uh, Shark TU 96 um, repair series. And uh, it's concerning the distorted image on the uh, picture tube. And so I was sitting there thinking about what might be causing that. And uh, I remember there's an electrolytic capacitor related to the video output tube. And I also remember that if uh, if you watched a few videos back, I repaired a 12 volt black and white uh, portable that had a zigzag uh, corn road distorted image, and uh, that turned out to be a one microfarad at 16 volt or something like that electrolytic capacitor that was related to the video output I see. And so taking that information, I I wondered if there might be some kind of relation between these two, and. Uh, the capacitor in question uh, lies here. I forget exactly where it's connected to the tube, but I believe it's one of the grids. I don't have the schematic handy at the moment. Uh, but I took it out and here it is. It's a 3.3 microfarad at 350 volts uh, electrolytic capacitor and it's hooked up to my multimeter on capacitance. And as you can see, it's completely dead. There's no reading at all. It's not shorted, but there's just nothing there at all. <clears throat> Um, I also took this one out, which is a 1 microfarad at 400 volt capacitor. Uh, that's in a different part of the circuit. Uh, that's uh, in the, uh, I believe that's in the boost circuit of the flyback transformer. This one reads uh, good in terms of capaci capacitance, but I don't have an ESR meter to uh, completely verify whether it's good or bad. I already called the electronic shop and I do have a replacement for this one but they don't have a proper replacement for this one because their top voltage for that value is uh, 350 volts and this one's 400 volts. So I might just use the original, uh, I'm not completely sure. A 350 volt might work, I'll have to check exactly what, what uh, voltage it, it actually is under. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, I'll have to visit the electronics store and uh, replace that capacitor and see what happens. Okay, here's the schematic, and here you can see uh, C702, which is the 3.3 microfarad capacitor. And as you can see, it's connected to the second grid of the uh, video output tube, so that could definitely be causing issues. And uh, somebody on the antique radio forum told me that the um, horizontal frequency must be off. And here's the circuit for that section, and I'll be checking this, uh, this section out as well to see if uh, we've got any bad components there. So yeah, we'll see what happens.